Good news, everybody. You've asked for it, and now here it is available. The first ever Franchise Kicks t-shirt. Here on the screen, you will see the front of the t-shirt, Franchise Kicks, with the copyrighted trademark logo for Franchise Kicks, back of the shirt, Man Size 13 Sneaker Show. The shirt is available now. If you go to the website www.teespring.com forward slash franchise kicks, I will also leave a clickable link in the description box below. T shirt is available now in white, or you can get it in black, depending on what you want. Shirts will run all the way up from a size small to a size 5XL for you big dogs out there. Also available. There is our franchise kick stickers available also. So go ahead and jump on this deal available for a limited time. And thank you for supporting. Here today with a new unboxing from a new website. I've never tried Stock X before. And I missed out on the Royal Ones when they came out a while ago now, several weeks ago. And I thought about buying them off of like Twitter and but for my size people are trying to charge like 275 shipped 290 shipped and uh, I'm not paying that much for the Royal Ones so uh, I say you know what let me check stock X and stock X had my size 14 in the Royal Ones for $220 plus what, 15 in shipping 235 shipped and so I say, you know what? This is a good time to try out Stock X. I've never tried it before. I tried the Goat app. Everybody knows my thoughts on the Goat app, if you follow me. So it's Stock X's turn. Let's see what happens. But this package was sent from Detroit, Michigan. So I guess Stock X must be located in Detroit, Michigan. Uh, I don't have my address cut off, but here's the box. Let's see exactly how the services of stock X are. Open in the box. Got your Jordan 1 box. So far, everything's good. There's your man size 14, because I go up to 14, my Jordan 1s, 3s and 4s see what these look like. Stock X, it's your turn. Wow me. Nike. Stock X card. But the CEO of Stock X, his name is Josh. And once again, just like GOAT, their people only sign with like a squiggly line. Why is that? Whatever. Take a so it says take a picture of your shoe, show us your verified authentic title of the Instagram hashtag blah blah blah. Okay. Condition dead stock, 100 percent authentic. Actually, no, ship was only $13.95. So I got these for uh two thirty three ninety five shipped. That's much, much better than paying what people on Twitter are trying to get for this shoe. Actually, the person who sent these in included the original Reebok Reebok. Why the fuck would he say that? <laughs> Foot Locker receipt when they were purchased Providence, Rhode Island. So far, presentation's good. I know these Royal Ones, the leather quality of these things are very spotty. Some pairs have really good Leather on them, very tumbled, very soft, very nice. Other pairs, the leather quality, I guess, is flat, feels cheap. So let's see. Hopefully, I got a nice one. Right shoe. Leather on this one is very tumbled, very soft. At least the right shoe. Some people have gotten the Royal Ones where the right shoe is tumbled. The left shoe isn't, or vice versa, where it looks like you got two totally different shoes because the quality control on these were crap. Leather on these, 
on this right shoe is butter. As you can see, the swoosh is very tumbled. I can't see my camera right now. Swoosh is tumbled. Left shoe. Thank God. I got one of the good, the good royal pairs. Thank God. So here we go. You got your uh, stock X authentication little tag they attached to your shoe. That's actually really nice. And then this pair came with the laces rolled up like this. From what I understand, I think the pairs with the laces came like this had possibly better leather quality than the ones that came just like all wrapped up, like bunched up and shoved in. Then it came with a stock X sticker. So, stock X, what do I think of stock X? Well, for my first transaction ever with stock X, the shoes I got, let me check them a little bit closer just to make sure. Smell like new Jordan 1s. Yeah, these have no flaws on them. So, Stock X, are you legit? Yes. This transaction through Stock X went very nicely. I got these in hand in, what, five, five business days. So a person was able to ship to goat what? and goat to me what? in five business days which is actually about normal if you buy from like nike at least at least for me nike usually takes about four business days sometimes three so the presentation you know is good this authentication hang tag is good um This even says, verified authentic. Notice, please inspect shoe before removing tag. All claims null and void if removed. So I guess once you remove your little green authentication tag, there's no returns or any complaints. But I've got no complaints about this shoe. I got a Royal One that has good leather on the shoe. High quality, tumbled, soft. These, the leather on this is comparable to my uh, Bread 2016s. I would not, some people said this was shattered backboard quality and it's nice but it's not shattered backboard quality of leather it's nice though but it's not so let me give you a close-up look at these so I can show you that I actually thank God I got a good pair but um, I gotta say stock X I'm happy with you good job no complaints from me. So StockX, you've got yourself a new customer.